destroy these viruses. He discovered that every cell and molecule vibrates at its own distinct frequency. And that by beaming plasma rays of the same frequency at those cells, you actually amplify their frequency and destroy them. This happens because of something known as resonance. When two things of the same frequency come together, they actually amplify each other's frequency. This is actually how opera singers are able to destroy wine glasses. When their voice matches the resonant frequency of the glass, it makes the glass vibrate at a higher frequency, making it vibrate more intensely and causing it to shatter. Resonance can basically amplify the vibration of anything and destroy it. From something as small as a wine glass to something as large as a bridge. Now in this same way, Rife created a device that could shatter cells by matching the resonant frequency. By sending an impulse of electromagnetic waves of the same frequency as the cell, you amplify its vibration and disintegrate it. When he did, his Rife machine destroyed 60% of the cancer cells in his patients. Now sadly, some greedy people at the time thought that this was bad for their medical business and getting money from cancer patients, so they found ways to destroy Rife's career and his new invention. Even on Google, some pages like Medical News still tell you that this device is a hoax. Now, this would be believable if other people had not reproduced the same results also using frequencies and resonance. Such as this guy from TED Talks who also discovered electric fields of certain frequencies destroyed cancer cells. We now know that cancer is vulnerable between the frequencies of 100,000 Hertz and 300,000 Hertz. So now we attack leukemia cells. He then shows how he destroyed leukemia cells and also pancreatic cancer cells using resonance. Also being able to destroy 60% of cells like Rife did and slowing the growth rate of cancer by 65%. And here's another video of another person also discovering a very similar thing. By using a technique called histotripsy which uses sound waves to destroy cancer tissue. Also by matching the cancer's resonant frequency. All of this has now been called resonant frequency therapy if you want to look it up further. And keep in mind, if any medical website tries to say that it's fake, it could be because the cancer industry is literally $1.58 billion. And this frequency treatment would get rid of all the things that generate that money. Just keep that in mind.